Koninklijke Philips NV, literally Royal Philips, stylized as Philips, is a Dutch multinational conglomerate corporation headquartered in Amsterdam, one of the largest electronics companies in the world, currently focused in the area of healthcare and lighting. It was founded in Eindhoven in 1891 by Gerard Philips and his father Frederick, with their first products being light bulbs. It was once one of the largest electronic conglomerates in the world and currently employs around 74,000 people across 100 countries. The company gained its royal honorary title in 1998 and dropped the electronics in its name in 2013. Philips is organized into two main divisions Philips Consumer Health and Well Being, formerly Philips Consumer Electronics and Philips Domestic Appliances and Personal Care, and Philips Professional Health Care, formerly Philips Medical Systems. The lighting division was spun off as a separate company, Signify NV, formerly Philips Lighting prior to 2018. The company started making electric shavers in 1939 under the Philoshave brand, and post-war they developed the compact cassette format and co-developed the compact disc format with Sony, as well as numerous other technologies. As of 2012, Philips was the largest manufacturer of lighting in the world as measured by applicable revenues. Philips has a primary listing on the Euronext Amsterdam Stock Exchange and is a component of the Euro Stocks 50 Stock Market Index. It has a secondary listing on the New York Stock Exchange. Acquisitions include that of Signetics and Magnavox. They also have had a sports club since 1913 called PSV Eindhoven. History The Philips Company was founded in 1891, by Gerard Philips and his father Frederick Philips. Frederick, a banker based in Zaltbommel, financed the purchase and setup of an empty factory building in Eindhoven, where the company started the production of carbon filament lamps and other electro-technical products in 1892. This first factory has been adapted and is used as a museum. In 1895, after a difficult first few years and near bankruptcy, the Phillips is brought in Anton, Gerard's younger brother by 16 years. Though he had earned a degree in engineering, Anton started work as a sales representative. Soon, however, he began to contribute many important business ideas. With Anton's arrival, the family business began to expand rapidly, resulting in the founding of Philips Metallgloiumfabriek NV Philips Metal Filament Lamp Factory Limited in Eindhoven in 1908, followed in 1912, by the foundation of Philips Gloilampenfabriken NV Philips Lightbulb Factories Limited. After Gerard and Anton Phillips changed their family business by founding the Phillips Corporation, they laid the foundations for the later electronics multinational. In the 1920s, the company started to manufacture other products, such as vacuum tubes. In 1939, they introduced their electric razor, the Philoshave, marketed in the U.S. using the Norelco brand name. The Chapel is a radio with built-in loudspeaker, which was designed during the early 1930s. Topic. Philips Radio On the 11th of March 1927, Philips went on the air with shortwave radio station PCJJ, later PCJ, which was joined in 1929 by sister station PHOHI, Philips Omro Holland Indy. PHOHI broadcast in Dutch to the Dutch East Indies, now Indonesia, while PCJJ broadcast in English, Spanish, and German to the rest of the world. The International Program on Sundays commenced in 1928, with host Eddie Starts hosting the Happy Station Show, which became the world's longest-running shortwave program. Broadcasts from the Netherlands were interrupted by the German invasion in May 1940. The Germans commandeered the transmitters in Huizen to use for pro-Nazi broadcasts, some originating from Germany, others concerts from Dutch broadcasters under German control. Philips Radio was absorbed shortly after liberation when its two shortwave stations were nationalized in 1947 and renamed Radio Netherlands Worldwide, the Dutch International Service. Some PCJ programs, such as Happy Station, continued on the new station. Topic. 
Stirling engine Phillips was instrumental in the revival of the Stirling engine when, in the early 1930s, the management decided that offering a low-power portable generator would assist in expanding sales of its radios into parts of the world where mains electricity was unavailable and the supply of batteries uncertain. Engineers at the company's research lab carried out a systematic comparison of various power sources and determined that the almost forgotten Stirling engine would be most suitable, citing its quiet operation both audibly and in terms of radio interference and ability to run on a variety of heat sources common lamp oil, cheap and available everywhere, was favored. They were also aware that, unlike steam and internal combustion engines, virtually no serious development work had been carried out on the Stirling engine for many years and asserted that modern materials and know-how should enable great improvements, encouraged by their first experimental engine, which produced 16 W of shaft power from a bore and stroke of 30 mm x 25 mm. Various development models were produced in a program which continued throughout World War II. By the late 1940s, the Type 10 was ready to be handed over to Philips's subsidiary Johann de Witt in Dordrecht to be produced and incorporated into a generator set as originally planned. The result, rated at 182 hundredths W electrical output from a bore and stroke of 55 mm x 27 mm, was designated MP1002CA known as the Bungalow Set. Production of an initial batch of 250 began in 1951, but it became clear that they could not be made at a competitive price. Besides, with the advent of transistor radios with their much lower power requirements, meant that the original rationale for the set was disappearing. Approximately 150 of these sets were eventually produced. In parallel with the generator set, Philips developed experimental Stirling engines for a wide variety of applications and continued to work in the field until the late 1970s, though the only commercial success was the reversed Stirling engine cryocooler. However, they filed a large number of patents and amassed a wealth of information, which they later licensed to other companies. Topic. Shavers The first Phillips shaver was introduced in the 1930s, and was simply called Phillishave. In the U.S., it was called Norelco. The Phillishave has remained part of the Phillips product lineup until the present. Topic. World War II On 9 May 1940, the Philips directors learned that the German invasion of the Netherlands was to take place the following day. Having prepared for this, Anton Philips and his son-in-law Franz Otten, as well as other Philips family members, fled to the United States, taking a large amount of the company capital with them. Operating from the U.S. as the North American Philips Company, they managed to run the company throughout the war. At the same time, the company was moved on paper to the Netherlands Antilles to keep it out of German hands. On the 6th of December 1942, the British number no. 2 group RAF undertook Operation Oyster, which heavily damaged the Philips radio factory in Eindhoven with few casualties among the Dutch workers and civilians. The Philips works in Eindhoven was bombed again by the RAF on the 30th of March 1943. Fritz Philips, the son of Anton, was the only Philips family member to stay in the Netherlands. He saved the lives of 382 Jews by convincing the Nazis that they were indispensable for the production process at Philips. In 1943, he was held at the internment camp for political prisoners at Vught for several months because a strike at his factory reduced production. For his actions in saving the hundreds of Jews, he was recognized by Yad Vashem in 1995 as a righteous among the nations. Topic 1945 to 1999. After the war, the company was moved back to the Netherlands, with their headquarters in Eindhoven. In 1949, the company began selling television sets. In 1950, it formed Philips Records, which eventually formed part of Polygram. Philips introduced the audio compact audio cassette tape in 1963, and it was wildly successful. 
Compact cassettes were initially used for dictation machines for office typing stenographers and professional journalists. As their sound quality improved, cassettes would also be used to record sound and became the second mass media alongside vinyl records used to sell recorded music. Philips introduced the first combination portable radio and cassette recorder, which was marketed as the radio recorder and is now better known as the boom box. Later, the cassette was used in telephone answering machines, including a special form of cassette where the tape was wound on an endless loop. The C cassette was used as the first mass storage device for early personal computers in the 1970s and 1980s. Philips reduced the cassette size for the professional needs with the mini cassette, although it would not be as successful as the Olympus microcassette. This became the predominant dictation medium up to the advent of fully digital dictation machines. Philips continued with computers through the early 1990s. See separate article, Philips Computers. In 1972, Philips launched the world's first home video cassette recorder, in the UK, the N1500. Its relatively bulky video cassettes could record 30 minutes or 45 minutes. Later one-hour tapes were also offered. As competition came from Sony's Betamax and the VHS group of manufacturers, Philips introduced the N1700 system which allowed double-length recording. For the first time, a two-hour movie could fit onto one video cassette. In 1977, the company unveiled a special promotional film for this system in the UK, featuring comedian Dennis Norden. The concept was quickly copied by the Japanese makers, whose tapes were significantly cheaper. Philips made one last attempt at a new standard for video recorders with the Video 2000 system, with tapes that could be used on both sides and had eight hours of total recording time. As Philips only sold its systems on the PAL standard and in Europe, and the Japanese makers sold globally, the scale advantages of the Japanese proved insurmountable and Philips withdrew the V2000 system and joined the VHS coalition. Philips had developed a Laserdisc early on for selling movies, but delayed its commercial launch for fear of cannibalizing its video recorder sales. Later Philips joined with MCA to launch the first commercial Laserdisc standard and players. In 1982, Philips teamed with Sony to launch the compact disc. This format evolved into the CDR, CDRW, DVD and later Blu-ray, which Philips launched with Sony in 1997 and 2006 respectively. In 1984, the Dutch Philips Group bought out nearly a one-third share and took over the management of German company Grundig. In 1984, Philips split off its activities on the field of photolithographic integrated circuit production equipment, the so-called wafer steppers, into a joint venture with ASM International, located in Veldhoven under the name ASML. Over the years, this new company has evolved into the world's leading manufacturer of chip production machines at the expense of competitors like Nikon and Canon. In 1991, the company's name was changed from NV. Philips Gloilampenfabriken to Philips Electronics NV. At the same time, North American Philips was formally dissolved, and a new corporate division was formed in the U.S. with the name Philips Electronics North America Corp. In 1991-1992, Philips along with their subsidiary Magnavox, released the Philips CDI, a combined CD player and home video game console. It sold 1 million units and was discontinued in 1998 after being heavily criticized amongst the gaming community. In 1997, the company officers decided to move the headquarters from Eindhoven to Amsterdam along with the corporate name change to Koninklijke Philips Electronics NV, the latter of which was finalized on 16 March 1998. 2000s The move of the headquarters to Amsterdam was completed in 2001. Initially, the company was housed in the Rembrandt Tower. In 2002, it moved again, this time to the Breitner Tower. Philips Lighting, Philips Research, Philips Semiconductors spun off as NXP in September 2006 and Philips Design, are still based in Eindhoven. Philips Healthcare is headquartered in both Best, Netherlands near Eindhoven and Andover, Massachusetts, United States near Boston. In 2000, Philips bought Optiva Corporation, the maker of Sonicare electric toothbrushes. 
The company was renamed Philips Oral Healthcare and made a subsidiary of Philips DAP. In 2001, Philips acquired Agilent Technologies Healthcare Solutions Group HSG for €2 billion. Euros. Philips created a computer monitors joint venture with LG called LG – Philips Displays in 2001. In 2004, Philips abandoned the slogan Let's Make Things Better in favor of a new one, Sense and Simplicity. In December 2005, Philips announced its intention to sell or demerge its semiconductor division. On 1 September 2006, it was announced in Berlin that the name of the new company formed by the division would be NXP Semiconductors. On 2 August 2006, Philips completed an agreement to sell a controlling 80.1% stake in NXP Semiconductors to a consortium of private equity investors consisting of Kohlberg Kravis Roberts & Co. KKR, Silver Lake Partners and Alpinvest Partners. On 21 August 2006, Bain Capital and Apex Partners announced that they had signed definitive commitments to join the acquiring consortium, a process which was completed on 1 October 2006. In 2006, Philips bought out the company Lifeline Systems headquartered in Framingham, Massachusetts in a deal valued at $750 million, its biggest move yet to expand its consumer health business M. In August 2007, Philips acquired the company Zimmies, Inc. headquartered in El Paso, Texas for their medical informatics division. In October 2007, it purchased a more microprocessor patent MPP portfolio license from the TPL Group. On 21 December 2007, Philips and Respironics, Inc. announced a definitive agreement pursuant to which Philips acquired all of the outstanding shares of Respironics for US$66 per share, or a total purchase price of approximately €3.6 billion, US$5.1 billion in cash. On 21 February 2008, Philips completed the acquisition of VISICU Baltimore, Maryland through the merger of its indi direct wholly owned subsidiary into VISICU. As a result of that merger, VISICU has become an indirect wholly owned subsidiary of Philips. VISICU was the creator of the EICU concept of the use of telemedicine from a centralized facility to monitor and care for ICU patients. The Philips Physics Laboratory was scaled down in the early 21st century, as the company ceased trying to be innovative in consumer electronics through fundamental research. Topic. 2010s. In January 2011, Philips agreed to acquire the assets of Preethi, a leading India-based kitchen appliances company. On 27 June 2011, Philips acquired Sectra Mamia AB, the mammography division of Sectra AB, because net profit slumped 85% in Q3 2011. Philips announced a cut of 4,500 jobs to match part of an 800 million euros, 1.1 billion dollars cost-cutting scheme to boost profits and meet its financial target. In 2011, the company posted a loss of €1.3 billion, Euros, but earned a net profit in Q1 and Q2 2012, however the management wanted €1.1 billion Euros cost-cutting which was an increase from €800 million Euros and may cut another 2,200 jobs until end of 2014. In March 2012, Philips announced its intention to sell or demerge its television manufacturing operations to TPV Technology. On the 5th of December 2012, the antitrust regulators of the European Union fined Philips and several other major companies for fixing prices of TV cathode ray tubes in two cartels lasting nearly a decade. On the 29th of January 2013, it was announced that Philips had agreed to sell its audio and video operations to the Japan-based Funai Electric for €150 million, Euros, with the audio business planned to transfer to Funai in the latter half of 2013, and the video business in 2017. As part of the transaction, Funai was to pay a regular licensing fee to Philips for the use of the Philips brand. The purchase agreement was terminated by Philips in October because of breach of contract and the consumer electronics operations remain under Philips. Philips said it would seek damages for breach of contract in the US$200 million sale. 
In April 2016, the International Court of Arbitration ruled in favor of Philips, awarding compensation of €135 million Euros in the process. In April 2013, Philips announced a collaboration with Paradox Engineering for the realization and implementation of a pilot project on network connected street lighting management solutions. This project was endorsed by the San Francisco Public Utilities Commission (SFPUC). In 2013, Philips removed the word "electronics" from its name, becoming Royal Philips NV. On the 13th of November 2013, Philips unveiled its new brand line, Innovation and You, and a new design of its shield mark. The new brand positioning is cited by Philips to signify company's evolution and emphasize that innovation is only meaningful if it is based on an understanding of people's needs and desires. On the 28th of April 2014, Philips agreed to sell their Wooks Innovations subsidiary, Consumer Electronics, to Gibson Brands for 135 million United States dollars. On the 23rd of September 2014, Philips announced a plan to split the company into two, separating the lighting business from the healthcare and consumer lifestyle divisions. It moved to complete this in March 2015 to an investment group for $3.3 billion. In February 2015, Philips acquired Volcano Corporation to strengthen its position in non-invasive surgery and imaging. In June 2016, Philips spun off its lighting division to focus on the healthcare division. In June 2017, Philips announced it would acquire U.S.-based Spectronetics Corp., a manufacturer of devices to treat heart disease, for €1.9 billion, Euros, £1 billion pounds, expanding its current image-guided therapy business. In 2017, Philips launched Philips Ventures, with a health technology venture fund as its main focus. Philips Ventures invested in companies including Mitonomy 2017 and Deer Health 2019. In 2018, the lighting products division known as Philips Lighting NV was renamed Signify NV. It continues to produce and market Philips branded products such as Philips Hue color changing LED light bulbs. Topic: <laughs> Corporate Affairs. Topic. CEOs Past and present CEOs 1891–1922, Gerard Phillips 1922–1939, Anton Phillips 1939–1961, Franz Auten 1961–1971, Fritz Phillips 1971 to 1977, Hank Van Riemsdyk. 1977 to 1981, Nico Rodenberg. 1981-1982, Cor Dillon. 1982 to 1986, Wies Decker. 1986 to 1990, Cor Van Der Klut. 1990 to 1996, Jan Timmer. 1996 to 2001, Cor Boonstra. 2001 to 2011, Gerard Kleisterly. 2011 present, Franz Van Houtenseos Lighting. 2003 to 2008, Theo Van Dorsen. 2012 present, Eric Rondolet. Topic: CFOs. Past and present CFOs Chief Financial Officer 1960-1968, Cor Dillon 2015-present, Abhijit Bhattacharya Vice Presidents In January 2013, Hugo Barbosa Vasquez was hired to own market analysis and forecasting activities across all Philips businesses consumer lifestyle, healthcare and lighting and geographies. Topic: Acquisitions. 
Companies acquired by Philips through the years include ADAC Laboratories, Agilent Healthcare Solutions Group, Amperex, ATL Ultrasound, Echo, Lifeline Systems, Magnavox, Marconi Medical Systems, Philips Medical purchased Intermagnetics based out of Latham, New York for $1.3 billion in 2006, Optiva, Prethi, Pi, Respironics, Inc., Sectra Mamia AB, Signetics, VISICU, Volcano, VLSI, Zimis, portions of Westinghouse and the consumer electronics operations of Philco and Sylvania. Philips abandoned the Sylvania trademark which is now owned by Havels Sylvania except in Australia, Canada, Mexico, New Zealand, Puerto Rico and the USA where it is owned by Osram. Formed in November 1999 as an equal joint venture between Philips and Agilent Technologies, the light-emitting diode manufacturer LumaLEDs became a subsidiary of Philips Lighting in August 2005 and a fully owned subsidiary in December 2006. An 80.1% stake in LumaLEDs was sold to Apollo Global Management in 2017. Topic operations Philips is registered in the Netherlands as a Nomlos Venutschap and has its global headquarters in Amsterdam. At the end of 2013, Philips had 111 manufacturing facilities, 59 R&D facilities across 26 countries and sales and service operations in around 100 countries. Philips is organized into three main divisions, Philips Consumer Lifestyle, formerly Philips Consumer Electronics and Philips Domestic Appliances and Personal Care, Philips Healthcare, formerly Philips Medical Systems and Philips Lighting. Philips achieved total revenues of €22.579 billion Euros in 2011, of which €8.852 billion Euros were generated by Philips Healthcare, €7.638 billion Euros by Philips Lighting, €5.823 billion Euros by Philips Consumer Lifestyle and €266 million Euros from group activities. At the end of 2011, Philips had a total of 121,888 employees, of whom around 44% were employed in Philips Lighting, 31% in Philips Healthcare, and 15% in Philips Consumer Lifestyle. Philips invested a total of 1.61 billion euros in research and development in 2011, equivalent to 7.10% of sales. Philips Intellectual Property and Standards is the group-wide division responsible for licensing, trademark protection and patenting. Philips currently holds around 54,000 patent rights, 39,000 trademarks, 70,000 design rights and 4,400 domain name registrations. Asia. Topic. Thailand Philips Thailand was established in 1952. It is a subsidiary which produces healthcare, lifestyle and lighting products. Philips started manufacturing in Thailand in 1960 with an incandescent lamp factory. Philips has diversified its production facilities to include a fluorescent lamp factory and a luminaries factory, serving Thai and worldwide markets. Topic Hong Kong Philips Hong Kong began operation in 1948. Philips Hong Kong houses the global headquarters of Philips Audio Business Unit. It also house Philips Asia Pacific Regional Office and Headquarters for its Design Division, Domestic Appliances and Personal Care Products Division, Lighting Products Division and Medical System Products Division. In 1974, Philips opened a lamp factory in Hong Kong. This has a capacity of 200 million pieces a year and is certified with ISO 9001-2000 and ISO 14001. Its product portfolio includes Prefocus, Lensend and E10 miniature light bulbs. Topic. Mainland China Philips established in Zhuhai, Guangdong in 1990. The site mainly manufactures shaves and healthcare products. In early 2008, Philips Lighting, a division of Royal Philips Electronics, opened a small engineering center in Shanghai to adapt the company's products to vehicles in Asia. <laughs> India 
Philips began operations in India in 1930, with the establishment of Philips Electrical Co. India Private Limited in Kolkata as a sales outlet for imported Philips lamps. In 1938, Philips established its first Indian lamp manufacturing factory in Kolkata. In 1948, Philips started manufacturing radios in Kolkata. In 1959, a second radio factory was established near Pune. This was closed and sold around 2006. In 1957, the company converted into a public limited company, renamed Philips India Limited. In 1970, a new consumer electronics factory began operations in Pimpri near Pune. This is now called the Philips Healthcare Innovation Center. Also, a manufacturing facility, Philips Center for Manufacturing Excellence, was set up in Shakin, Pune in 2012. In 1996, the Philips Software Center was established in Bangalore, later renamed the Philips Innovation Campus. In 2008, Philips India entered the water purifier market. In 2014, Philips was ranked 12th among India's most trusted brands according to the Brand Trust Report, a study conducted by Trust Research Advisory. Topic: Israel Philips has been active in Israel since 1948 and in 1998, set up a wholly owned subsidiary, Philips Electronics Israel Limited. The company has over 700 employees in Israel and generated sales of over $300 million in 2007, Philips Medical Systems Technologies Limited. Haifa is a developer and manufacturer of computerized tomography CT, diagnostic and medical imaging systems. The company was founded in 1969 as Elsint by Elrin Electronic Industries and was acquired by Marconi Medical Systems in 1998, which was itself acquired by Philips in 2001. Philips Semiconductors formerly had major operations in Israel, these now form part of NXP Semiconductors. Pakistan. Philips has been active in Pakistan since 1948 and has a wholly owned subsidiary, Philips Pakistan Limited, formerly Philips Electrical Industries of Pakistan Limited. The head office is in Karachi with regional sales offices in Lahore and Rawalpindi. Topic: Europe. Topic: France Philips France has its headquarters in Ceresnes. The company employs over 3,600 people nationwide. Philips Lighting has manufacturing facilities in chalon sur seyon fluorescent lamps, Chartres automotive lighting, La Motte-Bouvrin architectural lighting by LEDs and professional indoor lighting, Longvic lamps, Mirabelle outdoor lighting, Nevers professional indoor lighting. Topic. Germany Philips Germany was founded in 1926 in Berlin. Now its headquarters is located in Hamburg. Over 4,900 people are employed in Germany. Hamburg Distribution center of the divisions Healthcare, Consumer Lifestyle, and Lighting. Philips Medical Systems DMC. Philips Innovative Technologies, Research Laboratories. Aachen Philips Innovative Technologies Philips Innovation Services Boblingen Philips Medical Systems, Patient Monitoring Systems Hershing Philips Respironics Ulm Philips Photonics, Development and Manufacture of Vertical Laser Diodes VCSELs, and Photodiodes for Sensing and Data Communication Topic. Greece Philips Greece is headquartered in Halandri, Attica. As of 2012, Philips has no manufacturing plants in Greece, although there have been in the past. Topic. Italy 
Philips founded its Italian headquarter in 1918, basing it in Monza Milan, where it still operates, for commercial activities only. Hungary Philips founded POC Philips Assembly Center Hungary in 1992, producing televisions and consumer electronics in Sikhsfehervor. After TPV entering the Philips TV business, the factory was moved under TP Vision, the new joint venture company in 2011. Products have been transferred to Poland and China and factory was closed in 2013. By Philips acquiring PLI in 2007 another Hungarian Philips factory emerged in Tomasi, producing lamps under the name of Philips IPSC Tomasi, later Philips Lighting. The factory was renamed to Signify in 2017, still producing Philips lighting products. Topic. Poland Philips operations in Poland include, a European financial and accounting centre in Lodz, Philips lighting facilities in Bielsko Biala, Pabianice, Pila, and Ketrin, and a Philips domestic appliances facility in Bialystok. Topic. Portugal Philips started business in Portugal in 1927, as Philips Portuguesa SARL. Currently, Philips Portuguesa SA is headquartered in Eras near Lisbon. There were three Philips factories in Portugal, the FAPAE Lamp Factory in Lisbon, the Carnoxide Magnetic Core Memory Factory near Lisbon, where the Philips Service Organization was also based, and the OVAR Factory in northern Portugal making camera components and remote control devices. The company still operates in Portugal with divisions for commercial lighting, medical systems and domestic appliances. Topic. Sweden Philips Sweden has two main sites, Kista, Stockholm County, with regional sales, marketing and a customer support organization and Solna, Stockholm County, with the main office of the mammography division. Topic. United Kingdom Philips UK has its headquarters in Guildford. The company employs over 2,500 people nationwide. Philips Healthcare Informatics, Belfast develops healthcare software products. Philips Consumer Products, Guildford provides sales and marketing for televisions, including high-definition televisions, DVD recorders, hi-fi and portable audio, CD recorders, PC peripherals, cordless telephones, home and kitchen appliances, personal care, shavers, hair dryers, body beauty and oral hygiene. Philips Dictation Systems, Colchester. Philips Lighting, sales from Guildford and manufacture in Hamilton. Philips Healthcare, Guildford. Sales and technical support for X-ray, ultrasound, nuclear medicine, patient monitoring, magnetic resonance, computed tomography, and resuscitation products. Philips Research Laboratories, Cambridge, until 2008, based in Redhill, Surrey. Originally these were the Mullard Research Laboratories. In the past, Philips UK also included Consumer Product Manufacturing in Croydon. Television Tube Manufacturing Mullard Simonstone Philips Business Communications, Cambridge, offered voice and data communications products, specializing in customer relationship management CRM applications, IP telephony, data networking, voice processing, command and control systems and cordless and mobile telephony. In 2006 the business was placed into a 60-40th joint venture with NEC. NEC later acquired 100% ownership and the business was renamed NEC Unified Solutions. Philips Electronics Blackburn, vacuum tubes, capacitors, delay lines, laserdiscs, CDs. Philips Domestic Appliances Hastings, design and production of electric kettles, fan heaters plus former Echo brand, thermotube, tubular heaters and hostess, domestic food warming trolleys. Philips Semiconductors, Hazel Grove, Stockport and Southampton, both also earlier part of Mullard. These became part of NXP. London Carriers, Logistics and Transport Division.
Mullard Equipment Limited Mel, which produced products for the military. Pi Telecommunications Limited of Cambridge. TMC Limited of Malmesbury. Pi TVT Limited of Cambridge. Topic: North America. Topic: Canada. Philips Canada was founded in 1934. It is well known in medical systems for diagnosis and therapy, lighting technologies, shavers, and consumer electronics. The Canadian headquarters are located in Markham, Ontario. For several years, Philips manufactured lighting products in two Canadian factories. The London, Ontario, plant opened in 1971. It produced A19 lamps, including the Royale. Long life bulbs, PAR38 lamps and T19 lamps originally a Westinghouse lamp shape. Philips closed the factory in May 2003. The Trois-Rivières, Quebec plant was a Westinghouse facility which Philips continued to run it after buying Westinghouse's lamp division in 1983. Philips closed this factory a few years later, in the late 1980s. Topic. Mexico Philips Mexicana Sa de CV is headquartered in Mexico City. Philips Lighting has manufacturing facilities in, Monterrey, Nuevo Leon, Ciudad Juarez, Chihuahua, and Tijuana, Baja California. Philips Consumer Electronics has a manufacturing facility in Ciudad Juarez, Chihuahua. Philips Domestic Appliances formerly operated a large factory in the industrial Vallejo sector of Mexico City but this was closed in 2004. Topic. United States Philips Electronics North American Headquarters is in Andover, Massachusetts. In early 2018, it was announced that the U.S. headquarters would move to Cambridge, Massachusetts by 2020. Philips Lighting has its corporate office in Somerset, New Jersey, with manufacturing plants in Danville, Kentucky, Dallas, Salina, Kansas and Paris, Texas and distribution centers in Mountain Top, Pennsylvania El Paso, Texas, Ontario, California and Memphis, Tennessee. Philips Healthcare is headquartered in Cambridge, Massachusetts and operates a health tech hub in Nashville, Tennessee with over 1,000 jobs. The North American Sales Organization is based in Bothell, Washington. There are also manufacturing facilities in Andover, Massachusetts, Bothell, Washington, Baltimore, Maryland, Cleveland, Ohio, Foster City, California, Gainesville, Florida, Milpitas, California and Reedsville, Pennsylvania. Philips Healthcare also formerly had a factory in Knoxville, Tennessee. Philips Consumer Lifestyle has its corporate office in Stamford, Connecticut. Philips Lighting has a Color Kinetics office in Burlington, Massachusetts. Philips Research North American Headquarters is in Cambridge, Massachusetts. In 2007, Philips entered into a definitive merger agreement with North American Luminaires company Genlight Group Incorporated, which provides the company with a leading position in the North American Luminaires also known as lighting fixtures, controls and related products for a wide variety of applications, including solid-state lighting. The company also acquired Respironics, which was a significant gain for its healthcare sector. On 21 February 2008, Philips completed the acquisition of VISICU Baltimore, Maryland. VISICU was the creator of the EICU concept of the use of telemedicine from a centralized facility to monitor and care for ICU patients. Oceania Topic Australia and New Zealand Philips Australia was founded in 1927 and is headquartered in North Ryde, New South Wales and also manages the New Zealand operation from there. The company currently employs around 800 people. Regional sales and support offices are located in Melbourne, Brisbane, Adelaide, Perth and Auckland. 
Current activities include Philips Healthcare, also responsible for New Zealand operations, Philips Lighting, also responsible for New Zealand operations, Philips Oral Healthcare, Philips Professional Dictation Solutions, Philips Professional Display Solutions, Philips Avant Professional, Philips Consumer Lifestyle, also responsible for New Zealand operations, Philips Sleep and Respiratory Care, formerly Respironics, with its ever increasing national network of sleep easy centres, Philips Dynalite Lighting control systems, acquired in 2009, Global Design and Manufacturing Center and Philips Silicon NZ Lighting Entertainment Product Design and Manufacture. South America Brazil Philips do Brasil Portuguese, Philips do Brasil was founded in 1924 in Rio de Janeiro. In 1929, Philips started to sell radio receivers. In the 1930s, Philips was making its light bulbs and radio receivers in Brazil. From 1939 to 1945, World War II forced Brazilian branch of Philips to sell bicycles, refrigerators and insecticides. After the war, Philips had a great industrial expansion in Brazil, and was among the first groups to establish in Manaus Free Zone. In the 1970s, Philips Records was a major player in Brazil recording industry. Nowadays, Philips do Brazil is one of the largest foreign-owned companies in Brazil. Philips uses the brand Walita for domestic appliances in Brazil. Topic. Color television Color television was introduced in South America by then CEO, Cor Dillon. Topic. Former operations Philips subsidiary Philips Dufar NL manufactured pharmaceuticals for human and veterinary use and products for crop protection. Dufar was sold to Solvay in 1990. In subsequent years, Solvay sold off all divisions to other companies Crop Protection to Uniroyal, now Chemtora, the Veterinary Division to Fort Dodge, a division of Wyeth, and the Pharmaceutical Division to Abbott Laboratories. Polygram, Philips Music Television and Movies Division, was sold to Seagram in 1998, merged into Universal Music Group. Philips Records continues to operate as record label of UMG, its name licensed from its former parent. Origin, now part of ATO's Origin, is a former division of Philips. ASM Lithography is a spin-off from a division of Philips. Hollensa Signaloperaten was a manufacturer of military electronics. The business was sold to Thomson CSF in 1990 and is now Thales Nederland. NXP Semiconductors, formerly known as Philips Semiconductors, was sold a consortium of private equity investors in 2006. On 6 August 2010, NXP completed its IPO, with shares trading on NASDAQ. Philips used to sell major household appliances white goods under the name Philips. After selling the major domestic appliances division to Whirlpool Corporation it changed from Philips Whirlpool to Whirlpool Philips and finally to just Whirlpool. Whirlpool bought a 53% stake in Philips major appliance operations to form Whirlpool International. Whirlpool bought Philips remaining interest in Whirlpool International in 1991. Philips Cryogenics was split off in 1990 to form the Sterling Cryogenics BV, Netherlands. This company is still active in the development and manufacturing of Sterling cryocoolers and cryogenic cooling systems. North American Philips distributed AKG Acoustics products under the AKG of America, Philips Audio, Video, Norelco and AKG Acoustics Inc. branding until AKG set up its North American division in San Leandro, California in 1985. AKG's North American division has since moved to Northridge, California. Polymer Vision was a Philips spin-off that manufactured a flexible e-ink display screen. The company closed in 2009. Products 
Philips core products are consumer electronics and electrical products including small domestic appliances, shavers, beauty appliances, mother and child care appliances, electric toothbrushes and coffee makers products like smartphones, audio equipment, Blu-ray players, computer accessories and televisions are sold under license, and healthcare products including CT scanners, ECG equipment, mammography equipment, monitoring equipment, MRI scanners, radiography equipment, resuscitation equipment, ultrasound equipment and X-ray equipment. Topic. Lighting products Professional indoor luminaires Professional outdoor luminaires Professional lamps Lighting controls and control systems Digital projection lights Horticulture lighting Solar LED lights Smart office lighting systems Smart retail lighting systems Smart city lighting systems Home lamps Home fixtures Home systems branded as Philips Hue Topic. Audio products Hi-Fi systems Wireless speakers Radio systems Docking stations Headphones DJ mixers Alarm clocks Topic. Healthcare products Philips healthcare products include Topic. Clinical informatics Cardiology Informatics in Telespace Cardiovascular, Excelera. Enterprise Imaging Informatics in Telespace PAX, XIRIS. In Telespace Family of Solutions. Topic: Imaging Systems. Cardio, Vascular X-ray Wires and Catheters, Verata. Computed Tomography, CT. Fluoroscopy Magnetic Resonance Imaging MRI Mammography Mobile C-Arms Nuclear Medicine PET Positron Emission Tomography PET – CT Radiography Radiation Oncology Systems Roots Ultrasound Topic. Diagnostic Monitoring Diagnostic ECG Topic. Defibrillators Accessories Equipment Software Topic. Consumer Philips Avental Topic. Patient care and clinical informatics Anesthetic gas monitoring Blood pressure Capnography DME Diagnostic sleep testing ECG Enterprise patient informatics solutions OBE TraceView CompuraCord ICIP EICU program Emergen Hemodynamic Intellispace Cardiovascular Intellispace PAX Intellispace Portal Multi-measurement servers Neurofed oils Pulse oximetry TASI Temperature Transcutaneous gases Ventilation Viewforum Excelera XIRIS XPER Information Management Topic. Coat of Arms, Logotype Topic Sponsorships In 1913, in celebration of the 100th anniversary of the liberation of the Netherlands, Philips founded Philips Sports Vereniging Philips Sports Club, now commonly known as PSV. 
The club is active in numerous sports but is now best known for its football team, PSV Eindhoven, and swimming team. Philips owns the naming rights to Philips Stadion in Eindhoven, which is the home ground of PSV Eindhoven. Outside of the Netherlands, Philips sponsors and has sponsored numerous sports clubs, sports facilities and events. In November 2008, Philips renewed and extended its F1 partnership with AT&T Williams. Philips owns the naming rights to the Philips Championship, the premier basketball league in Australia, traditionally known as the National Basketball League. From 1988 to 1993, Philips was the principal sponsor of the Australian rugby league team the Balmain Tigers and Indonesian football club side Persiba Balikpapan. From 1998 to 2000, Philips sponsored the Winston Cup No. 7 entry for Jeff Bodini Racing, later Ultra Motorsports, for drivers Jeff Bodini and Michael Waltrip. From 1999 to 2018, Phillips held the naming rights to Phillips Arena in Atlanta, home of the Atlanta Hawks of the National Basketball Association and former home of the defunct Atlanta Thrashers of the National Hockey League. Outside of sports, Phillips sponsors the international Phillips Monsters of Rock Festival. Topic: <laughs> Environmental record. Topic. Circular economy Philips and its CEO, Franz van Houten, hold several global leadership positions in advancing the circular economy, including as a founding member and co-chair of the board of directors for the Platform for Accelerating the Circular Economy PACE, applying circular approaches in its capital equipment business, and as a global partner of the Ellen MacArthur Foundation. Topic. Green initiatives Philips also runs the Ecovision initiative which commits to a number of environmentally positive improvements, focusing on energy efficiency. Also, Philips marks its green products with the Philips green logo, identifying them as products that have a significantly better environmental performance than their competitors or predecessors. Topic. L Prize competition In 2011, Philips won a $10 million cash prize from the U.S. Department of Energy for winning its L Prize competition, to produce a high-efficiency, long-operating life replacement for a standard 60W incandescent lightbulb. The winning LED lightbulb, which was made available to consumers in April 2012, produces slightly more than 900 lumens at an input power of only 10 W. Topic: Greenpeace ranking. In Greenpeace's 2012 Guide to Greener Electronics that ranks electronics manufacturers on sustainability, climate and energy and how green their products are, Philips ranks 10th place with a score of 3.8.10. The company was the top scorer in the energy section due to its energy advocacy work calling upon the EU to adopt a 30% reduction for greenhouse gas emissions by 2020. It is also praised for its new products which are free from PVC plastic and BFRs. However, the guide criticizes Philips' sourcing of fibers for paper, arguing it must develop a paper procurement policy which excludes suppliers involved in deforestation and illegal logging. Philips have made some considerable progress since 2007 when it was first ranked in this guide, in particular by supporting the individual producer responsibility principle, which means that the company is accepting the responsibility for the toxic impacts of its products on e waste dumps around the world. Topic. Publications A. Heerding, The Origin of the Dutch Incandescent Lamp Industry. Volume 1 of the History of N.V. Philips Gloilampenfabriek. Cambridge, Cambridge University Press, 1986. ISBN 0 521 32169 7. A. Heerding, A Company of Many Parts. Volume 2 of the History of N.V. Philips Gloilampenfabriken. 
Cambridge, Cambridge University Press, 1988. ISBN 0-521-32170-0 I.J. Blanken, The Development of N.V. Philips Gloilampenfabriken into a Major Electrical Group. Zaltbommel, European Library, 1999. Volume 3 of the History of Philips Electronics N.V. ISBN 90-288-1439-6. I.J. Blanken, Under German Rule. Zaltbommel, European Library, 1999. Volume 4 of the History of Philips Electronics N.V. ISBN 90-288-1440-X.